I can't believe you got into a fight, and that's how you get to debut on Raw. Very funny. I'm not debuting on Raw. I'm just having a match. They asked me here to wrestle, and that I can do. Tell that to the millions of people who will be watching you wrestle on Raw for the first time from their homes tonight. Even if this opportunity doesn't mean the same to you, don't waste it. Why do you think I brought tinfoil to take home the food from catering? <sighs> I'm serious. So am I. Listen, I hear you, but I also know why I'm here. Local talent almost never win these matches, but I do intend to make an impression. Hey, watch where you're going. Excuse my oblivious friend. Wait a minute, TBD? Yeah. I've heard of that. Welcome to Raw. See, making an impression already. Oh, whatever. Good luck out there tonight. You made it. Welcome to Raw. And you're welcome. You're lucky to have me. I'm gonna put on one hell of a show tonight. With an attitude like that? I hope so. In any case, the show's not too far off from starting. I'd suggest getting changed into your gear. <laughs> I'm ready. You are... wearing a t-shirt? <laughs> not just any t-shirt. This very TBD t-shirt. Why? Apparently Shotzi's whole thing with me is a beef about TBD booking. Getting a reminder of TBD in front of her? It's sure to make her mad. Mind games. Thinking of the psychological game? Smart. Listen, just don't tell anyone else we talked about this. I know there are some who would want me to make you change. Change? Me? <laughs> you don't know me that well. Right then. Good luck out there. It's Shotzi's opponent, who comes to WWE with a reputation. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from St. Thomas in the Virgin Islands, El Guapo, the Queen. Yes! I see she's repping a local promotion. Does her shirt say TBD? I know her. She's the captain. A bit of a legend on the indie circuit. I think she could give Shotzi some trouble tonight. Shotzi ready to roll over the competition tonight. Like a tank. Even though she hasn't been in WWE before, she's been in big matches all around the world. I don't think this stage is going to face her one bit. I don't know. I respect what she's done before this, but nothing can compare to the bright lights of WWE. At some point in this match, it will play a factor.
Look at this. Oh, from the rope. Looks like Shotzi's locked in on her opponent. Hit the ropes. Uh-oh. She adjusts it and reverses it. Ooh, what a forearm club. Standing drop kick. Great ups. Uh-oh. Face for a turnbuckle. Hooked up in the corner. The exploder. Bang into the corner. Shotzi's mind didn't look to be in the game there. Jump. Boom! It's okay, they weren't that pretty anyway. Driver. She starts to rise back up, but does she know where she is? Arm ringer in control. Oof! But here comes the fire. She's on unsteady legs in the corner, needs to recover. Ducks under, is go behind. Instead, what a German suplex. From the apron, through the air, and connects. Shotzi staggers up, struggling to regain any composure. Oh, nice takedown, they're gonna lock it in. Oh, oh, bell oh. lock, the little bell lock is in. This won't win the match, but it's doing a lot of damage in the process. And she's trying to ask for mercy, but not even tapping out can help her. Taking this one back to the ring now. She knows she's the best. She's just telling everyone else. Sky high. This superstar building incredible momentum. Oh, I mean, this is, I don't know how the superstar is doing it. Down and out moments ago. Back in it now. Shoulders down. And a shoulder is lifted before one. She is showing us something special here tonight. Uh-oh. The arms are hooked. Tiger suplex. Ducks through. Up and over. Selena Del Sol. Like a tank, Shotzi executing with reckless abandon. Lift off, Shotzi with a senton bomb. It's Shotzi's opening to take this. Looking for the victory. Wow. You got to give a lot of credit here. Withstanding what has taken out many other competitors. Shotzi's so composed, so in control now. Shotzi's showing no mercy out here. A heel hook locked in. You can almost hear the opponent yelling in agony. Shoulders down. This could be the one that does it for her. Forces the shoulder up after two. Both competitors digging deep into their well to keep this match going. Some showboating from Shotzi here. What grace float over to the DDT. Mike, her energy is fading rapidly now. Yeah, she is not looking good right now. And she's given the crowd a chance to really soak it all in. See her struggling to find her bearings. 
Got the arm. It's over. It's got to be over. Oh, nowhere to go. Nowhere to hide. Couldn't be tap, tap time. This is the worst case scenario. I can't believe it. When was the last time a local competitor beat a WWE superstar? I don't know, but it looks like Shotzi is just as bewildered as us. I think furious is the word you're looking for. Shotzi from behind, taking out her frustration. To the outside, coming our way. A loss like this could put Shotzi's title opportunity against Bianca Belair at risk. Shotzi is relentless, but there's a reversal. Setting Shotzi up for something big here. We got to move. And down through the table. Talk about a raw debut. What the? <laughs> Sorry about the table, boys. But Shotzi asked for more from Miss TBD, so she got it. Thanks for the mic, Byron. And by the way, watch our show! Well, that sure was something. For God's sake, hold on to your mic next time, Saxton. Wow, Byron, that's the most action you've seen in years. What the heck was that? We gotta go. Can't imagine the suits are gonna be too happy. Let's let this suit speak for himself, shall we? Damn. Of all the impulsive, unhinged disasters I've witnessed in my career, my dear. That had to be one of the most excellent. Wait, what? You went out and defeated Shotzi. And then, when things went sideways, you kept your head, stood up for yourself, and made a memorable moment for everyone in the WWE Universe. Well done. So you'll still pay me then? You're not only getting paid. I'd like to offer you a full-time WWE Raw contract. With all due respect, I'm not sure if I'm the type of person you want working for you. You have a lot of assumptions about who we are and what we want. And with all due respect, I'd suggest letting us decide those things for ourselves. I heard how people responded, and I'm telling you, WWE wants you. I truly appreciate the offer, sir, but I... Can we have a moment? I don't really think we need to... Just give us a second. Why not? I'm just in the middle of a live show and trying to offer you a life-changing opportunity. But please, take your time. that wasn't you about to tell William Regal no to a WWE contract. Wait, is this you telling me to say yes to William Regal in a WWE contract? Why wouldn't you sign? Everything we've built together with TBD, our mission, you know how much it means to me. I don't want to abandon TBD, and I don't want to abandon you. TBD isn't going anywhere. You think I'm going to let our momentum stop just because you get to go to the bigs? No way! Give it a chance. You hate it here, you come back home. But don't say no to the adventure. I mean, it is kind of cool that Regal recognizes what I bring to the table. And that was only one match. You did that with what everyone assumed would be a quick victory for Shotzi. And you don't think this is selling out? Remember when we decided to start TBD? Of course I do. As much as I wish I could forget that show, that promoter had such a narrow vision of what wrestling should be. And we sat down at that diner and decided if we ever started a promotion, we would let all kinds of people with all types of ideas get in the ring and fight, literally, for their vision. Yeah, we were very idealistic before we had to pay bills. <laughs> Remember those contracts we signed with each other on those diner napkins? 
So we did follow through on all of those plans. Aside from coming up with a name besides TBD, of course. My point is, we had a mission. Still do. And now, you're getting a very real chance to take your vision to a company that has more reach than anyone else. You really want to make a difference and change this industry into what you think it could be? You can't say no. Guess I have to find Regal and tell them yes then. I'll let you get to it. Just don't big time us when you come home to visit, okay? <laughs> no promises. There she is, the so-called captain, who came out of nowhere to defeat Shotzi and earn a raw contract. Came out of nowhere for you, maybe, but anyone who's been paying attention to the independent wrestling scene knows this woman has been a champion and a cornerstone of the promotion known as TBD for quite some time. WWE and Raw are lucky to have her. Hello, hello, welcome to Raw, big fan, big fan. Really? Oh, everyone on the team is a long-time admirer. Ever since we got word last week. It's a quick pivot to squeeze you in, but we're used to things changing fast around here. Not a problem at all. Didn't think it would be? I'm Troy Simkin. Yep, I'm that guy. I'm sure you've heard the more established superstars mention their favorite WWE producer. I don't think I have. Hmm. Are you not mingling with your peers? That's kind of a must-do around here. Actually, we have several handy documents outlining all the unwritten do's and don'ts. Doesn't that make them written? But before we get sidetracked, what I was getting at is we already have a few ideas of how to use you. Oh, we'll be in touch. Do you maybe want to talk about some of the things I've been thinking or am interested in doing? Like I said, get settled. We're working on some ideas. Gotta run. Later, Cat. They actually call me Cap. Huh. Could have sworn it was Cat. Oh, well. We'll see where we land with the name. 